being a water sports enthusiast in Canada is full of challenges. For those of us who do it for a living, it's even tougher to get enough time on the water in the summertime. So we do our best to try and get away during the off season, find a little time on the water then. We thought we'd share some of them with you. As our pal Jimmy says, I gotta go where there ain't any snow. I gotta go where there ain't any blow. I gotta go where it's warm. That's why we love Shoe Schwab Ski and Board, because it's always summer at Shoe Schwab Ski and Board. Today's video segment's coming to you from Sperlonga, Italy. Where we're about to go have a couple of sets with uh, David and the guys over at Ski Nautico Longhetta. Come join us. Uh, I, I started here at Sperlonga in, Sperlunga in uh, 1979. I uh, was very young and skier and then uh, liked to teaching um, and then I become teacher, official teacher for the Federation and now I stay um, for nine months in Sperlonga to, to teaching with my group, with my member. Some stronger, some not and a lot stranger guy like Mike. Really strange, to, exactly. Yes, yeah, so really, really far. <laughs> it's the, more or less is the more far than my client, and uh, that's it. the school is uh, every week. Uh, every week we have two courses. Uh, have always and in the past, uh, choreograph boats. I have 296 uh, and uh, other older for for wakeboard. Um, we use that old stuff, American stuff. It's, that's just normal for water ski. Right. Well, that's the expectation. If someone comes, they want to see a master crafter or an yeah, sure, or one sure, of the major sure, because brands of boats. It's, it's uh, necessary because uh, a lot of people are expected to have uh, the American stuff because it's the best, I think. Uh, the, the boat is perfect, the ski is perfect. Uh, European ski also is okay, but not like the American ski. ski. It's, uh, I think it's the best. And weather-wise, this has been fantastic. These three days, we're 23 to 25 yes, in yes. the daytime. It's nice yes. and warm even in the morning. Beautiful flat water behind us. Yeah, generally, generally we have a, uh, a good weather. Um, in spring and autumn, uh, it's about 25 degrees uh, until uh, mid uh, of November. After change a little bit the weather. And uh, no wind normally. Uh, the lake is always uh, good for the good performance to skiing. We have two cores there and one for uh, when they arrive at the strange gale wind and we use it that. Uh, but normally we use it in front. Well, also we have a ramp. You Maybe you make it. We saw the jump up. ramp yes, on the so way. There yeah. is jump ramp there. We got that in our sort of opening uh, welcome to the lake. So, <clears throat> here in Sperlonga, Italy, yep. with David, Ski Nautico Langata. I can never say that very well. David, it's been a treat. Look forward to skiing again soon. Yes, I have. Uh, All right. I'm very happy to know you. <laughs> All right. Thanks. We had an amazing trip and especially enjoyed our week in Sperlonga. It's a beautiful seaside town of 3,000, nestled on the Mediterranean, just 130 kilometers southwest of Rome. Spectacular scenery, mozzarella di bufalo, that's to die for, with walks along the beach and sunsets that left my bride quite content with our time there. If you're thinking of an amazing ski holiday, think of ski Nautico, Laghetto, and Sperlonga, Italy.